All right, so we're going to start a 2D sketch on this surface here. So I'm going to click on that. And then I'm going to go to Project Geometry and click on that shape there. Okay, see how that's going all the way around? I'm going to click on that. Okay, it should go yellow. Let's go Finish Sketch. Okay, it's going to stay yellow. So what I need to do now is go to Plane here, but I want to click on the arrow underneath and go Offset from Plane. Okay, I'm going to click on that shape again and we're going to enter in 90 because you want it to offset towards the front of the car here to 90. Okay, and this is completely up to you. If you wanted to make it go all the way to the front, okay, maybe you could make it or maybe a little bit bigger. Let's do like 130 maybe. Okay, you could easily make it come up towards the front of the car. If you didn't want the nose of your car to be that big, let's just say you want to make your car a little bit lighter. Let's say you make it maybe 50. Okay, it's completely up to you how you want to design your car. Just for this demonstration, I'm just going to do 90, which is roughly in the middle there somewhere, and press OK. Okay, now what I'm going to do is start a sketch on that new plane that we've just made. All right, so I've gone to Start 2D Sketch, and now I'm just clicking on this work plane. All right, now I'm going to click on Slice Graphics, which is down the bottom here. Click on that. And it's going to slice my car so I can see what I'm drawing. Okay, what I'm going to do now is just go to the line tool. Just going to zoom in a little bit. And I want to keep this shape pretty similar to this shape here. Okay, and I'm going to make the same kind of shape down here, making sure it's below the surface of the car. So that's the top surface of the body. I want to make sure it's all below in here. So we're going to start on this line here. I'm going to click. Come down to about here. Right. Come across. Go up 90 degrees just a little bit. I'm just going to go right click OK. So at the moment I've got a line from here to here, from here to here, and then here to here. So what I'm going to do is use the arc tool to finish this one off. So I'm going to click there. And I'm going to click at the top there and then arc it around. Now can you see when I'm arcing there's a little tangent um, icon that's coming up around here, just watch that. Can you see how it's popping up? I'm going to wait until I can see it, which I can now, and then press my uh, left mouse. Okay. So as you can see they're pretty similar in shape and that's what we want. And I'm making sure it's below the surface of the, the car as well. Right, just to make sure that the nose goes all the way into the car body. So once we're done with that, we just can go to finish sketch. All right, and now we're going to complete our loft. So I can see loft here, so I'm going to click on that. All right, now it's asking us to select the sections that we want to loft. So I'm going to click to add. All right, and I'm going to find that sketch. Okay, see when I highlight over sketch three, this shape here lights up white okay so I know that's right so I want to click that okay and now I want to add the other sketch I've just created which should be sketch 4 and can you see how that's turned white over here now when I hover over sketch 4 click on that okay now can you see how that's lofting all the way to the front okay there's a few little changes you can do to this um, if we just go to conditions Okay, you can now start to change the shape of that nose. At the moment, you can see it's starting off high and going directly down to the front. You can change some of these. All right, can you see how that's changed the shape? Okay, direction, um, condition. I've just changed that one before. Okay, you can also make it dip down and then come back out. Okay, I personally like that shape there. Okay, so that's what I'm going to keep. However, it's completely up to you. Um, you can play around with those and see what type of shape that you want. Um, then you can keep that for your car. Alright, so I'm happy, so I'm going to click OK. Alright, and there's the nose for my car.